Some help. Oh, this is bad. This is very bad. <laughs> I, I need help, so I. <gasps> Ow! Good morning, sidestep. Ah, oh, that's all I need. What's wrong? What are you doing so far from the beach? <laughs> now I can't even see the water. Where's Hamilton's box? I gotta talk to Maggie and Hamilton. They'll know what to do. They're at the oasis. It's that way, but... Hey, thanks, Rudy. <laughs> I gotta hurry! I gotta get help! Hamilton, wake up! Time for breakfast! Don't you want cereal? I just love ponios. And bring my favorite bowl, the blue one! Mm. Beast? Can I sleep just a few more minutes? Oh. oh, all right. Let me get dressed first. I love ponios. You love ponios. The very best breakfast, as everybody knows. Beast, you're here. Where's Hamilton? In my big blue bowl, my big blue Beast? bowl. My Beast? ponios and milk in my big blue bowl. Ow! Oh, good morning, Sidestep. Beast, I need help. Where are Hamilton and Maggie? Hi, Sidestep. What's wrong? You're pretty far from the beach. Are you lost? Well, you see, I was watching... I know. And... He's hungry. You can have breakfast with us. We're having ponios. See? No, look, could you give me a hand? I... Morning, Hamilton. Morning, Beast. Maggie! Sidestep, what are you doing so far from the water? A whale just He came for breakfast. But crabs need to be near water. Yes. What if he gets too dry? Would everyone please be quiet? <sighs> Thank you. And look, a whale just washed up on my beach, and it needs help to get back into the water. I'm too small to do it myself. <gasps> a whale? Oh, no! A whale! A whale! What's a whale? It's a very, very big sea creature. But how can we get it back into the water? Whales are huge! I'll help. I'm big and strong. That's true. And if we bring ropes and shovels to dig away the sand... If we all help, I'm sure we can put the whale back in the ocean. I'll get some equipment. Thanks, Hamilton. Please hurry. But, uh, aren't we going to eat first? There's no time. Whales need water even more than crabs do. Oh. Can you help us carry these beasts? Okay. Oh, I'll help. Can we bring the cereal too? We'll eat after we help the whale, okay? Don't you want to see the whale? Whales are even bigger than you, Beast. Bigger than me? Uh-huh. Wow, that is big. Oh, boy, whales are bigger than me. Let's go. Hey, hey, wait up. Oops, sorry, Sidestep. Oh, sure, forget about Sidestep, why don't you? Nobody ever remembers the crab. Oh, ew. Your claws pinch. Uh, uh, uh. Well, what are we waiting for? To the beach. Hurry, Beast. The whale's been out of water a long time. Where's the whale? She's over there. Come on. Whoa! Whoa! I still don't see anything. Think it moved? Oh no, she couldn't have. Come on, 
on! Hurry! There she is! How you holding up? Not so good. Hi! I'm Maggie, and this is the Ferocious Beast. She's not very big for a whale. Well, you don't look very ferocious for a beast. And the lady's got a point there. Besides, I'm just a baby whale. You should see my mom. My name is Hamilton Hawks. I'm pleased to make your acquaintance. It's nice to meet you all, but I'm getting very hot and dry. Do you think you could maybe... Put you back in the water? No problem. Sure. Then we can have breakfast. I'll lift her head. Can you grab her tail, Hamilton? I'm trying. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ooh, that tickles. <sighs> that feels good. Oh, and how. <laughs> <laughs> Now that's a whale. It is a whale, isn't it, Maggie? And how? Mommy! I was stuck on a beach and I was really hot, but then I met Sidestep and Maggie and Hamilton and the Ferocious Beast, who isn't very ferocious, and they put me back in the water. We were happy to help! Bye, everybody! Thanks! <gasps> Bye. 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 Take care now. Hey, nice kid. Sidestep, you were very brave to come all the way to the oasis to get help. Uh, it was nothing. Oh, can we please eat now? <laughs> okay, Beast, we'll go back to the oasis. This hero rescue stuff sure makes you hungry. Hey, hey, why don't you stay and have breakfast with me? Plenty of seaweed to go around. Um, maybe some other time? Okay, more for me. <laughs> Let's move out. I love ponios, you love ponios. The very best breakfast, as everybody knows. In my big blue bowl, my big blue bowl, my ponios and milk in my big blue bowl. <laughs> A flag for nowhere land. <sighs> when is Maggie getting here? <sighs> Soon, Beast. What do you feel like doing today? I feel like waiting for Maggie. Yes. Maggie always comes up with such great things to do. I don't know what we would do without her. Yes. It sure would be boring around here. Well, sometimes I come up with good ideas. How about the time we went digging for buried treasure? That was fun. Or the time we went bird watching? That was fun too. Or sailing? <sighs> I sure wish Maggie would get here. Hmm. Well, I'm going to finish making our lunch. <sighs> wow, Beast, that's a nice hat you have there. What hat? You know, your little bird hat. It's not a hat, it's a bird. Shoo, 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 shoo. <laughs> I suppose this looks funny to you. <laughs> oh, come on, bird. Don't you have anything better to do? Don't you have to find worms or lay an egg or something? Hi, Beast. Hi, Hi Maggie. Maggie. Wow, Beast. That hat is really very nice. It's not a hat. It's a bird. And it won't go away. <laughs> shoo! Shoo! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Beast, maybe if you 
ignore him, he'll go away. Besides, we have an adventure today. My mother had this old piece of cloth, and I thought we could make a flag for Nowhere Land. Oh, good idea, Maggie. I'll get my paints. That's a nice palm tree, Maggie. What about mine? Uh... Um... Yours is nice too, Beast. Ah, <sighs> there. Oh, add some polka dots in that corner, Hamilton. <sighs> I wish this bird would get off my head. <laughs> Now, I'm just going to add my box. And I'll paint in the path. And I'll add a pumpkin. Beast, that's too much paint. No, it's not. It's just the right amount. Oh. <laughs> there, all done. It's very nice. Now we just need to wait a moment for the paint to dry. Is it dry yet, Maggie? Almost. Oh, it just needs one last thing. It's almost dry now. I can tell. A flagpole, of course. Good idea, Hamilton. Catch, Maggie. Oh, this will be great. There. Now, where are we going to plant the flagpole? Hmm. I know. We should plant this flag on top of highest mountain. That's a long walk. Hop aboard. Okay. Oh, I'll be right back. Okay, let's go! Mm. Mm. <sighs> this seems like a nice place to have our lunch. Yes, it seems like a very nice place for peanut butter sandwiches. Oh, but I made cucumber sandwiches. This seems like a very nice place for cucumber sandwiches. <laughs> yes, it does. Mmm, I'm hungry. My, my. These sure are strange-looking rocks. Yes, and that certainly is a strange bird. He can't stay on your head forever, Beast. I'm getting used to it. Why don't you offer your new little friend there a bite to eat? I'm sure he must be hungry. <sighs> These are very good sandwiches, Hamilton. Hmm. Thank you, Beast. Would you like the last one? Yes, thank you. Mm. 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 place for the bird? Yes, it is. It's a very good place. <laughs> Goodbye, little bird. Goodbye. Goodbye. That was pretty funny, you know. 
the bird landing on my head and all? But he did look good on top of our flagpole. Much better than on my head, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Maggie. We've been waiting for you. Where are we going today? Beast, give Maggie a chance to catch her breath. Oh, that's all right. Where would you like to go? I think we should visit the desert. We haven't been there in a while. What do you think, Hamilton? It would be nice to see Kelly again. I'll have to fill the canteens. Don't forget my sunglasses and my sandals. Oh, not those sandals. You walk better without them. The sand gets too hot on my feet. Oh, all right. I thought for sure we'd see Kali by now. So did I. Well, I need a drink of water. I'm so thirsty. Here, beast. Hold on, not too much. Save some for later. Oh, all right. But I could drink a whole swimming pool. I wonder where Kali is. Well, we're not going to find him standing here. Let's move out. What's wrong, Maggie? Hamilton, this is very strange. But I think that cactus is following us. I don't think I heard you right. Did you say that cactus is following us? Mm-hmm. Why am I stopping? Really, Maggie? You do know that plants don't walk? This one does. I can't hear you. Okay, I'll prove it. Beast. Move out, please. I wish somebody would make up her mind. Don't look at the cactus. Now, look! See? There it is. It moved. No, it didn't. That's a different cactus. Will you please tell me why you're whispering? It's nothing, Beast. Just keep going. All right, all right. No! Don't look at it! Now look! <gasps> what are you whispering about? Stop, Beast! Again? But Maggie... Cactus plants don't move. They do in Nowhere Land. Greetings, little Miss Maggie, Hamilton, and the Great Spotted One. I love when he calls me that. Hello, Callie. I have to ask you something very important. Could somebody please tell me what is going on? Move in closer, beast. Callie. At first, Hamilton and I thought it was our imaginations. But then we realized that that cactus plant has been following us. What? I think these two have had too much sun, Kelly. Beast, be quiet. Will you please tell them that cactus plants don't move? They do in nowhere land, oh great spotted one. <laughs> See, I told you. It is lonely here in the desert, and the poor little fellow is obviously taken with you. He's very shy. Hello, little cactus. How are you? Oh, the poor thing seems to be frightened. I'm Hamilton. This is Maggie. 
and this rather large fellow is a ferocious beast. I guess you know Kelly. Kelly, I'm awfully thirsty. Will you take us to the lemonade spring? Good idea. It's not too far from here. Let's move out. Our little cactus friend is right over there. He has certainly taken a fancy to you. I'm going to see if he wants a drink of lemonade. It's very hot. Would you like a drink of lemonade? Would you like a drink? I wonder if he understands. Let's ask him something else. I know. Little Cactus, do you want to be friends? You do understand. I suppose he doesn't get many offers of friendship. All creatures of the desert avoid him because of his sharp quills. We can still be friends and be careful not to get stuck. It's time for lunch. I'll get things ready. That was delicious, Hamilton. The lemonade added a special touch. It's time for us to go. The little cactus appears sad at the thought of your leaving. Please don't be sad. We'll come back very soon to visit you and Kali. Maggie, I just thought of something. How will we find our new friend when we return? Beast is right, Maggie. There are lots of other cactus plants in the desert. Oh, I have a great idea. I'll be right back. I'm going to fill our canteens with lemonade. Make sure the lid is on tight, Maggie. Look! Oh, Hamilton, what a perfect idea. That sombrero will make it easy to find our little cactus when we return to the desert. I will lead you to the edge of the desert so you won't get lost. Thank you again, Callie. Move out! We'll be back, little cactus. 